What's up guys, Dark Cloud back again, and by the way, I had the episode number right last time. It was 17, now it's 18, just so you guys know. Uh, in case you missed last episode, it, the playlist is always linked in the description down below if you want to go check it out. But, <clears throat> I team recapped in the last episode for myself as well as you guys, and team is on the layout right there. So, as you can see, we got a nice new Gengar on there, and also... I do have a 16 member, it's Brandon the Empoleon, and that's all you really need to know. I'm getting right into this because uh, I kind of want to, you know, get through Ice Path, like I got, I, got, I got a lot planned, you know? This is the start of a new recording session that I'm doing. End up doing just kind of like one video in the last one. Which, uh, not gonna lie, that kind of threw me off quite a bit. <clears throat> there we go. The game volume was too loud, so I gotta adjust that real quick. <sighs> Alright, so let's hit 34, so that means we're probably gonna go ahead and do a switch out of the team lead, and I wanna use Bean a little bit more in this episode give me a little bit of time to shine it's always really good when you let you know beans fight babies I hear that beans are really good you might even say they're super effective against babies I don't really know what that means while I'm saying it but I'm saying it oh man it's like 11 o'clock right now I'm doing a little bit of late style recordings right now so I'm trying my best to kind of like stick with it and like write it out because uh, this is probably like the most last minute I've recorded these episodes since I started the series. So it's night Sunday and I'm trying to record the next like uh, three episodes being Tuesday, Thursday, Friday episodes. We're gonna see how that goes, you know? Uh, that's definitely the hope right now, but ugh, who knows really? I could just kind of peter out after like one or two and I'm just like mm, mm, mm can't do it can't do it I also really don't want to put Empoleon in the front because it's gonna mess the whole layout up right now um I don't I don't really want to fight that guy I don't think I need to maybe I do need to do I need to I don't think I do actually can I just walk I almost can uh, the only plus side I get from doing that is... Uh, <laughs> Anyways, the only plus side to fighting this guy is getting his item, who which might be a Master Ball, so... You know. Why not? Why not? Hmm. Mm -hmm. Good gameplay, good gameplay. I know, I'm just owing all, of, all, all the time. I really feel like they should have just gone... Um, unknown O and just like, you know, circle inside a circle. Kind of like how Meltan's eye is, you know? Uh, I think I'm gonna let someone else handle this. I don't think Steelix actually gets a ground type move in this generation at the very least. I'd actually be very happy to prove wrong right now. It's also level 25, so I don't think it's really... I knew that. I knew it had dry skin because we um, we fought one earlier. I want to say Jasmine had it, but that still doesn't sound right in my brain. Um, you've got Sky Uppercut. Sky Uppercut. Yeah, let's go with you. Brandon, come back. You are you're just invisible. You're invisible on this team. Invisible Brandon over here. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Ramsey out here with the uh, the sand veil, dodging them rocks, and also doesn't get hurt by the sand. Like that's that's actually pretty useful, honestly. Honestly, though. Ah, I'm dead now. Got me with the rock tomb. <laughs> that whole four damage, just mind bogging, mind bogglingly, nailed it. Terrible for me. 
<sighs> I also fixed the camera. Um, I realized that it, I had it like really zoomed out for some reason and I don't know why. So I zoomed it back in, you know, so you guys can see the nice, you know, face. And, uh, you know, we get this nice close relationship where you can see me um, forgetting moves and then not forgetting moves, but then forgetting moves. Uh, I will stay in for the Trico. I got something good I want to try out. Ooh. I see you, Trico. I see you. Landing them quick attacks in the sand. You see me landing them poison jabs in your stomach, though? In your face? I'm such a restless person, man. Like, my legs hurt from running, and yet I'm still, uh... Just swiveling in the chair like I I was so close just three more upgrades of the ball and I would uh I would get the master ball granted I'm about to get it anyways so I'm not too concerned um that just closed me in okay nice that was pretty easy but, uh, Oh yeah, bro, we're, we're gonna finish this like no problem, no problem. It's been like a few minutes and I'm pretty close to fighting uh, Chairman Rose, you know? Him and his noodle hair head wig. Mm. I can't think of another word. I don't know. I just don't like his hair. It feels like he's I feel like he's more known for his hair than his evil plan. There's an eyelash, I think, on my glasses. Did I get it? I think I got it. Hear that, or it's an eyelash on my eyelash, which is like better. Maybe. I got this, guys. I tackled it. So I was playing Minecraft um, with my girlfriend tonight, and um, I was teaching her about how to make a path uh using like water buckets on lava and you know like um if the lava turns into like cobblestone then you probably shouldn't mine while you're right on top of it or else you're gonna fall into some lava probably and i'm not the most experienced minecraft person um but i can do that much information and it's also not really listened to a lot of times so it's like well all your stuff just burned in that lava, so that sucks. And we're moving on. But you guys all know, you know, you don't just move on from all your stuff burning in lava. You sit and you just dwell on it forever. <clears throat> Whoops. I got him. Does anyone have an electric type move for a Pelipper? No, but Brandon resists all of its stab. <clears throat> and maybe I'll just get to go ahead and use Sword Stance. Because oh, why not? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. He's trying to make it so I can't see him. It's almost like the the tension in here is so thick that you could cut it with a knife. Do I double resist that? No, just single. Do I one shot with this? Ooh, no. He's looking for that confusion though, with me being plus four attack. 
but he doesn't get it. I don't know if anyone is watching the new Pokemon anime, but like... There... Okay. So Team Rocket has like a new um, device to fight, you know, your main protagonist like Ash with. And a Pelipper always delivers it to them with it like in its mouth. And I'm just sitting here thinking, there's gotta be a better way. You've got like Corviknight that can carry multiple people. Pretty sure it could carry like, you know, a device in its claws or something. I don't feel like it'd be that hard to train. I don't know, I, I, I just don't think a Pelipper is the best way sticking it in its mouth. Maybe I'm the crazy one. Maybe I'm like, nah, what do you mean? Uh, you, uh, uh, Pelipper is the most cost effective thing. That's why we're using it. I, I feel like I was starting to get uh, mafia style into there and I didn't mean to. Uh... I don't really want to deal with anyone getting like paralyzed right now. Oh man! Ooh. Yeah, all right. I can feel it. I can feel it. I can feel it. I can feel it. I'm getting real tired. And I need a second to uh, compose my thoughts as the yawn feeling pass. It's not gone yet though. Like it's. I, I think that's another thing I'm like waving for. You know. Uh, no thanks, I don't I don't really want to deal with that. Thank you, Bean Bean. Bean's the best bean. Maybe Bean will evolve soon though. That'd be pretty tight. Oh. Man, man, man. No, I'm good, Lyra, thanks. I think I'd rather just fight this guy than take your call. I would definitely rather, you know, fight this evil crime organization that could definitely kill me than take your call. <clears throat> I feel like that was... I That's something I kind of hope that they maybe, like, adjust or... I'm trying to think of the right word. Um, really just make it a little bit better, I would say. And not as annoying with the phone if they ever remake Johto again. Because, man, that phone is so annoying on... Well, not even just replay. Like, throughout the whole game, like... You don't really want to take every call from, you know, Hiker Joe over there. You just kind of want to play the game. So, Soul. I want to see if the mud shot come out. But I feel like there's got to be a better way, you know, like, um, mm. you could probably make it more like a verse seeker, but you use the entire map and it just kind of like highlights trainers, uh, on routes that's like, hey, there are trainers on this route that want to fight and in order to find out exactly who they are, you need to call them. So each person has like a route number or the area that you got their number next to them so you know which ones are which. That'd be a way to do it. It's not, it's probably not the best way, but it's just a way that wouldn't be quite as annoying. Because I don't want to hear about your slowpoke evolving or whatever the garbage thing you're saying is. <clears throat> I just want Ramsey to learn Seed Bomb really bad, but I don't know if that's actually a move in this game. Hmm. If I was more of a competitive mindset, I bet that'd be good. Oh, right. There's like a whole other floor or whatever for this. I completely forgot. Do these stairs just take me right through the building? Isn't that what it is? Ooh. Actually, that's being a probably can use. Hold on.
Mm, I'll wait for it. I think I wouldn't mind giving Soul the expert belt. Wait, can I ask them to move it now? Hold on. Yeah, let's go. Give me these items. Just to make sure I avoid, though, any potential problems with this. I played this game for 32 hours. I feel like half of that's gotta be grinding, because I've only had like 18 episodes of the series, and if they're 30 minutes, then it should only be like 9 hours if it's straight play, but like, it, I know it's not. Right, how do I get the... Gotta like, wait for them to like, move to the Machop. Wave incense? Okay, let's go, that's, that's, um... Mm. That's shmoney, shmoney, shmoney. I think I tried so hard to say the word shmoney. And... Alright, Pataya Berry. Pataya Berry. Expert items. Especially that expert belt. <laughs> yeah, I'm pretty funny. I really actually do like to think I'm uh, like a fairly funny person, but I also don't think people really enjoy my jokes. So maybe not. Ooh, fun fact. Uh, so you guys know, uh, I, I assume most of my viewers are probably um, American viewers. So over in, um, I'm gonna say certain parts of Europe because I'm not 100 but I learned this in my French class through high school. Um, what like Americans consider the first floor, um, they actually consider like a ground floor, and the next floor up is the first floor. So I wonder if in different uh, like countries where the game is, they actually label their floors differently. I don't know. Just an interesting you know thought. Maybe I'll download, um, like, a <clears throat> French version of, like, X and Y and see what they say in it. Ooh, I missed! I'm Oh, you don't have... <laughs> he doesn't have the ability. Uh, Lexio. Oh, Grit. Grit's got this. Plus, Grit's gonna give me that shmoney right now. Yeah, that's why you better give me double the money you were going to give me. I don't have a happy hour event Pikachu to do anything else, so. Oh, it's actually a person that matters. Uh, nope. Mm hmm. Um. Let's go Brandon. Brandon's got this. Oh, no, no, no. We're not using none of that uh, physical stuff. We're all special out here. Yeah, laid. I'm gonna go grit because I resist both stabs again. Um, let me go side beam. Okay, I don't like that. I don't like that. He even got the crit on me. Oh, and he just went for psycho cut. I was super dead right there. Alright, so that's pretty fun. Uh... Alright, one second. We're gonna run back. I'm gonna grab someone out of the box. That's a very sad death. Grit's been with the team for so long. I actually, I don't even need to go all the way back. Let's see. I got a perfectly good Metagross right here. I've got uh, a Water Absorbing Pillow Swine. Mm, I kind of want the Psychic Typing replaced though. So I'm either looking at the Metagross or this Mime Jr. Or I guess this Azelf. Or 
the scrum pig. Um, obviously it really should just go with Metagross. Yep, look at that guy. Look how powerful he looks. Alright. I think I'm just going to leave him in there right now with the amulet coin. I don't really need it, and Metagross is just going to get the experience share anyways. I really don't know what's wrong with uh, Empoleon not showing up on the layout. Yeah, look at that, it just puts Metagross off-center. Oh well, that's how it's going to be right now. Probably going to mess with uh, a little bit of uh, OCDs, but, you know. Uh, I'm not going to fix it. Because it helps me to have my experience share mod in the last slot, so my mind's like, yep, that's the one you're training. I know for a fact, like, I'm almost done with this place. Because, like, I just fought an admin, right? Oh, there's another one. Cool, cool. <clears throat> I still kind of can't believe that Galway just one-shotted my Hypno. I know he had Swords Dance up and got a crit, but it's still... Mm. It just doesn't feel good. I am, like, right on par with them. Bro, I got Sand Veil. I'm just gonna use that sand and you can't hit me. That's how that works. I'm one trying this thing, right? Yeah. I feel like it kind of backfired that I, uh... wanted to evenly train my team, you know? Oh! Loom. Wow! Um, if he's the same level as I am or close, I know he has Sky Uppercut. But I also know, then, that he does not really have any other moves that can hit me. So I'm pretty sure. <laughs> nope, he has no moves that can hit me. <laughs> Alright, no problem. We got this Shadow Ball just for you, buddy. Mm hmm, mm hmm, clean one shot. Let's go. I mean, there's no reason for me not to use Cuormo, right? Especially if he just, like, is gonna swap out. There's no way he only has, like, Mach Punch to hit me, right? Okay, he usually moved it was a Mach Punch. What was it? <laughs> He's got Counter. I forgot that I learned that. But I'm just like, no, no, no. No touchy. Isn't Gengar just great? If I wasn't training a pseudo-legendary right now, I'd be gaining so much experience. <sighs> but what are you gonna do with a pseudo, you know? I'm trying to finish this poor episode out, you know? Yes, thank you. Please just fight me. I don't care what you're saying. I get it, you have a dumb, evil plan. Let's move on. Alright, um... Let's go Brandon. Having a Steel-type is really nice to avoid those, uh, like, normal and flying and... Rock. Bug, I think. Poison. Steel is really nice. Didn't they have to, like, nerf it in later generations because it was, like, such a good defensive typing? Or is this dark right now still? I don't know what that's doing for you, but okay. Bet we're raising our stats. I bet I can get this, uh, Metal Claw attack raise. 
after I hopefully kill you with it. Nope. <laughs> Once more. I didn't get it. Kabu tops. Uh, I don't imagine he has like a flying type move. He might have a bug type move, but I'm not that scared of like Fury Cutter. I think the move I should be most scared of is like Slash. <laughs> or I guess Sand Attack? Sure, yeah, mm-hmm, Sand Attack, mm-hmm. I'm, I'm very scared of Sand Attack, can't you tell? Because I can't, I can't land my move. Oh, uh, man. Kabutops just cutting into the ground using Sand Attack is a very nice image in my brain. Really? Really, though? That didn't feel necessary. Can you stop enduring? Like, I need to hit you once, preferably. Alright, Poison Jab. Could have done that earlier, would have been way more effective than you using Sand Attack. Alright, I definitely gotta swap out. There's gotta be someone I can use on whatever this next thing is. That's gonna be better than minus two accuracy. Yep, there's a lot of better things. Um, because Ramsey doesn't have a grass type move. So I don't remember looking if he learned Seed Bomb. I know for a fact in later generations he does, but I don't know about this one. It's fine. While I'm fighting this, like, little baby Squirtle who apparently is going to raise his defense and be annoying, I will look this up. Squirtle out speeds me, too. So I think we're just going to both go plus six all the way to defense, and we'll go from there. Nice. Yep, where's going plus six? He does learn Seed Bomb at 41. So I'm actually not too far off of it, but like, I also don't know what I'm gonna end up forgetting. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Actually quite a bit for a resisted hit. Maybe it's better if I just go for the surf then because he didn't raise his special defense he raised his physical i wonder if squirtle has huge power i don't know i feel like he's doing quite a bit with me uh i mean i, I guess i didn't raise my defenses at all but like i don't know i feel like he's doing a lot Let's go with the pack though to finish him off. I'm getting curious now. Like, I, I mean, I'm resisting his hit, and like, Emolian probably has decent defenses, right? I don't know, maybe I'm just kind of like assuming too much about Empoleon. But I also don't imagine Squirtle has like a super powerful attack stat either. Oh, good, he's coming. <laughs> mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I sure did defeat them all. I'm pretty good, yep. Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah, that's right. I forgot I'm playing hard gold. I was talking way too much. I just want to, you know, get out of here. Please let me out. I've been in here for too long. There we go. And... I'm out. Okay, 
So, that's going to be the end of this episode. episode. It's a little bit shorter, I think, judging by my um, time. Oh, my arm hurts. Um, I'm going to probably just start the next episode over in Mahogany Town just so we can get right into Ice Path and maybe end up fighting Claire by the end of the episode. But, I'll see you guys then for Thursday. 